Hi and welcome. In the first video we saw um, some of the facts about um, the sampling function in the Blofeld. And now in the second video I want to show you how you can get the sample player function into the Blofeld. So first of all, if you have a Blofeld keyboard, you already have the sample player included. So you can skip um, the installation part or you can go straight to the next video. But if you have the Blofeld desktop, you should stay tuned. Because um, if you have the Blofeld desktop, you have to install um, the license SL um, separately. It's not included in the Blofeld desktop. And the reason for this is um, the Blofeld desktop was um, first designed um, without sampling or, or sample player included. And then when Waldorf developed the keyboard version, they also developed um, the sample player in the operating system. But this development was not included in the price for the original Blofeld, so Waldorf decided, decided to um, create a upgrade um, product so that you can get um, the sampling uh, or the sample player even if you have not the wall of um, Blofeld keyboard. You can criticize them or not, it's your decision. But this is what Waldorf did, so um, yeah, you have to buy the Blofeld and you have to buy this. And when you buy a used um, wall of Blofeld, sometimes the license SL option is already included. And you can see it when you turn on the Blofeld. So let's take some camera. And I turn it off and I turn it on and on the display it says license SL. Okay. I hope you can see it. Yeah, and when the sampling option is already installed, of course, you don't have to do this. But if not, um, I'm explaining it now how to install the sampling um, or the sample player. And it's actually quite easy. It's not as complicated as it might be because you don't need any screwdriver. You just need this CD. Um, so of course you have to prepare your Blofeld. You have to connect it to the power. You have to plug um, in the USB cable. You need a computer, it can be Windows or Mac. Yeah, you need this and um, you need a MIDI player, which is um, the Wall of Spectre software. Okay, so um, when you have set up all your devices, you now need three MIDI files. The first one and the third one are on this disk but you can also download them free on the world of website. And the second one is the most important one because the second MIDI file which you will play to the Blofeld will activate the sampling functionality. So the first file is the one to get a um, unique code from your Blofeld device. I'm going to show it later because Wolof has a nice uh, tutorial, a nice manual how to do this and I don't need to show it here and actually I don't know if um, it, it would work because my uh, sampling function is of course already installed but I'm going to show it here on the computer. I hope this is good enough. So um, the first one, the first MIDI file is to get the unique code out of your Blofeld. Then you have to take this code, type it in in the world of website and then you get the second MIDI file which you play back to the Blofeld which will activate the sampling function or the sample player. I always say sampling, I don't know why. But of course it's a sample player. And um, the last MIDI file is there to um, load in all the factory samples into the Blofeld. So the third MIDI file is optional. You don't have to do this if you want to have your own samples, 
But if you want to listen to the um, factory samples, which are okay, I would say, um, you can load in um, these factory samples. So um, everything you need is actually on the Wall of website, except for your unique um, activation code or license code. And um, you can find the two codes actually on on this product. One is here on the back side. This one is not important. And then you have one code here on the inside of the case. Maybe I can show it to this camera. Yeah, it says um, license activation key. Yeah. So you need this code from the inside. And let's jump to the Waldorf website. So you type in waldorfmusic.com, you go to hardware, select Blofeld of course. Then you have to go down to downloads. And then you can see here the section for the license SL. And you click on the PDF. And here you get the manual from Waldorf. So how to install the license SL. Step one, of course, connection and firmware. You have to connect your blowfield um, via USB to your computer. Um, make sure to have the latest firmware on the blowfield. And um, the second step is to download the Spectra software. This is also included here, but you can download it free from the Waldorf website. Install Spectre, start Spectre. Then in the settings you have to um, turn off the MIDI inputs. Select Blowfield as the MIDI output. Um, and then you can use Spectre to load in um, MIDI files into the Blowfield. So you have this um, upgrade button here on the Spectre surface. And when you click on there, you have to select the file and then you can play it directly to the Blowfield. So step four, identify your Blowfield um, challenge code. This is the first MIDI file, you remember. And when you play it to the Blowfield, um, the display will show something like this. So it's nothing to worry about, it's just the code you need. Then you can turn off the blowfield again if you don't need this or you can press the play button, I don't know. But um, the blowfield will show you your unique code which you need together with this code. So you need two codes, one from the blowfield, one from the inside of this box. Um, then step five, redeem coupon codes with um, challenge code in my Waldorf. So you go to um, the Waldorf website, you go to My Waldorf, and maybe you need an account, and then you can click on Redeem a coupon code. You type in um, the first code, I think it's this one. Let's see. Yeah, and the second one, the second code is the one from the Blowfield, which you have to type in two times. Yeah, challenge code and re-enter the challenge code. This is the one from the Blowfield and then you click on redeem. And then you should get um, your second MIDI file. You click on my software on the right side in the menu and then you should get um, the license SL MIDI file. Step six, transfer um, Actually, you should transfer this uh, MIDI file to the Blowfield and then you can transfer the samples to the Blowfield. Okay, so that's it. So, easy way to activate your sampling function or sample player function in the Blowfield. And now I want to show you the factory samples and of course I want to show you um, the second um, sample sets which is also for free as I download on the Waldorf website because 
these are maybe the samples um, which you are going to use to start playing around with um, with your refreshed and upgraded low felt.
Thank you. 